Good morning, folks. This is uh, Gig Apps Exposed here on YouTube. And uh, it's Friday morning. Um, just wanted to give you a little quick update and then talk about some things. But I, uh, I was supposed to post a couple of videos the past couple of days. And, uh, you know, I had to work. And later on in the day, I got tired. And I just, I just was, you know, exhausted. So... I waited till today to post them, but I combined the one that you guys probably already saw was the one combined from yesterday um, and um, from Tuesday, <clears throat> but yesterday's <clears throat> was only really a partial video from the one that I recorded um, yesterday as well, but I'm not, you guys will probably see that one before you see this one so i probably won't post this till later tonight uh, i'm gonna try and at the worst uh, it'll be saturday morning but hopefully you'll you'll see all these videos that i you know the ones that i did in the past couple days so i i wanted to uh keep in mind that if you if you did watch the other video about easy cater and doordash and if you have not even if you don't do catering or you're not in the large order program Please watch it because it's important that you find you listen to the information that's in that. Um, so, anyways, um, just to recap about what had happened, um, you know, I got, in short, I got a uh, an order from yesterday. Uh, it was a it was an actual catering order from DoorDash, and I haven't got one of them in a long time. It's probably been about a year. And I, I do some deliver that uh, occasionally, but I haven't done that in a while. And deliver that is, is an app in which it's all catering, but it doesn't mean you're going to get all kinds of great money from it because they have what's called a tip pool and where they combine, even if someone tips $1, no dollar, you know, $1 or $1,000, right? They supposedly put it in this big tip pool, which I disagree with, and it is, uh, it's not good because I believe in doing work based on merit. In other words, you do the work, you get the money. You know, screw this collectivism crap like, oh, uh, uh, there's, you know, there's no first, second, third place. We all win. All of us are winners. We're all going to, you know, you came in fifth, you're going to get an award. No, no thank you. Um, I just don't believe in that. So the deal is, is that I took this order and it didn't pay more than what it was showing. And I suspected strongly that it was the, the tip or the, any tips that were in there were stolen or, um, they manipulated it in some way. Um, and what I mean by that is, <clears throat> it's funny when I called support to talk to them, DoorDash that is, that they told me, oh, there's no tip on this order because this was ordered from, from the website and whatever, right? But why did they show me a tip of $12 in the, in the, uh, in the app when I, when I finally delivered it? See, I figured out a few things, folks. They're psychologically playing mind games on us because they figured if they don't show us a tip, then they'll feel like we got ripped off. So what they do is they'll either just show, it, in other words, if it's all base pay, they'll show that you got a tip when you may not have got one or you got one and they ripped it off and or reverse it where they steal from the tips and put it into the base pay. And I've been catching them a lot doing that like especially with just regular large order program orders you know like uh, picking up um, you know a hundred dollar order right and it'll say showing it'll show um, I don't know it'll show like ten dollars or twelve no twelve twelve seventy five whatever and then when you go drop when you drop it off and deliver it it'll say oh twelve seventy five tip and 225 base pay when they actually gave when the customer actually gave you a $15 tip 
But what happened is, is DoorDash just didn't pay you the, uh, they didn't pay you the base pay, which is the delivery charge. They're playing a lot of games. Now, in summation, because I want you guys to go and watch the video, because I talked about a lot of things. Uh, but it's weird how DoorDash used to do a lot of catering orders, and now they call it the large order program, but they're using Easy Cater plus Deliver That. Okay, and you'll see in the video what I what I talked about. So there's it's weird. It's like and I and I've made some connections there, and you have to listen to the video for it, but it, it just sucked. Okay, now on the screen here, you can see it says 51%. You're getting priority on higher paying orders. I have not been over 50% in months, folks. Months and months. I've been laying between like 10% and basically 25 to 30 at the most. Because the, the orders have been so terrible. But you probably heard in the other videos too that I was talking about how... I see that, yeah, if you take one after another, they usually keep you busy, but it doesn't mean you're going to make a whole lot of great money, and you may have to drive lots of miles to get to get it. It's, it's just a big game. It's been, been a big collusion in game for a long time, folks. I, aren't you getting tired of it? Aren't you getting sick of it? I am, but I'm not, I'm not going to end the fight with it. Um, we need, to, we need to go after them and hold them accountable for this crap. But, like, it was so disgusting because yesterday's order, like, I, I ended my dash after that. And then I, I, I didn't even come out at last night. I, 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 just, I wasn't even feeling good last night. I took the night off. I was going to come out from 3 to 11. And um, I ended up not doing that. <clears throat> and uh, so now, but I feel good because I got a good rest. I think I was dehydrated, too. I got dizzy and uh headache I, that's never happened to me before make sure you stay hydrated in the hot weather folks you know bring a water with you in the car you know things like that because you you think that you know everything's good until you start getting headaches and dizzy <laughs> it's because you're not drinking enough water anyways um yeah so it's friday um and like like i said you guys won't probably see this until uh until um later on tonight um uh so <laughs> probably i don't know it'll probably be at uh six or seven or five something like that but um i'm gonna if something else interesting happens or comes up during my shift i'll probably make another video because you know different things happen during the, during the shifts and i i'm always recording always making uh you know videos to uh to keep you guys updated on stuff going on too, you know. Um, I have other videos too that I have not posted. And it's like I'm always behind. But that's okay because at least like if I ever had to take a vacation or something or whatever. At least I'd have some content to post that I've already, you know, made. And a good a good content creator does that. You know, we make several, several videos uh, as backups and things, you know. Uh, so, yeah, it's... Uh, Geez, I can't believe it. It's the 30th, and uh, tomorrow will be the 1st of July. It's just uh, summer seems like it's going fast. It's only, you know, a couple months. But we'll hopefully try to enjoy the summer. Right, folks? Don't let DoorDash and these companies drain all the energy and life out of you. You need to, you know, if you can, possibly have go out and have some fun, take a mini vacation or something. You know, um, most of us, though, <laughs> we're, we're by the coattails every day trying to make money just to pay our bills, right? And uh, that's why, like, I, like myself, the only reason I, I um, watch other channels, like big gig tube channels or even medium-sized ones, is just to see what what bullshit that they're, that they're talking about now. There are some really good channels out there. You just have to know which ones to watch and look out for. Because they're not going to... Uh, a lot of these channels are really out for themselves and they're not going to be honest with you. Um, so you got to watch out for that, folks. And you guys know which ones to watch out for because I've warned you over the years, right? Over the past couple of years over at my DoorDash Sucks channel. 
If you've not, if you are new here and you listen to this video, I do have another channel called DoorDash Sucks, and that's my original channel. And most of you have come over here from that channel over to this one. And I want to think that the ones who have really, really care about the community and the drivers. I mean, we should be caring about one another because you're in. If you're doing this type of work, you know, you might say, "Well, I'm in, I'm independent." You're not, there's no such thing as independent, folks. You've been lied to your whole life about that, about stuff like that. You need you need to come out of the matrix. You know what I mean? <laughs> None of us are independent. You never were. You can't do anything independent of Big Brother looking over your shoulder. You know what I mean? Um, well, I, I think that's about it for the video. I just wanted to um, kind of give a general uh, talk and let you know what's been going on <clears throat> and uh, about the past couple days and stuff, you know? So make sure, please, watch those other videos, folks, uh, that I posted because they're important. Um Hopefully you'll get something out of it. It'll help you, okay? All right, with that said, uh, happy Friday, happy weekend. Um, I hopefully will be posting through the weekend. I'll be working. I work, I'm working every day, folks, so uh, pretty much, you know, when, you, when you're when you not making the money, you, you have to work every day, right? So hope you're doing well. Write in the comments, uh, you know, comment if you like, and uh, I'll catch you guys and gals on the next one. Take care.